Hey them foos, Big T here and I'm back with another video and this one is kind of informal, you know, not like a main kind of topic thing, but I just wanted to kind of talk about uh, sports games and all that kind of stuff on uh, Switch and my, um, apparently I just forgot about how much I enjoyed uh, sports games portably and uh, how I'm excited for things like uh, NBA 2K18, um, RBI Baseball, which is a game I actually already have on the uh, Xbox One digitally, and I'm excited that that's coming to uh, uh, Switch as well. And, uh, you know, other sports games in the future, um, you can even throw in stuff like, uh, you know, racing games, because, you know, uh, in a way that those are sports games as well. Uh, I think the motocross game MGXP or something like that is coming. I heard that was coming recently, and um, and I just realized like even uh, though I had the you know the big console version and I would play that uh, at home and whatnot. Um, even then, I ended up playing like the portable versions of sports games a whole lot more. Uh, because you know the grindy nature of some of the video of some of the uh, sports games where you're doing like full season like I'm a guy who loves to play like full seasons uh, in my sports games and obviously for baseball that is utterly ridiculous because there's what 162 games or something like that in baseball uh, but you know long seasons bas basketball is obviously 82 games and uh, you know, football being the shortest one, so you can kind of go through football seasons a lot quicker. Uh, but um, I just remembered, you know, like I still to this day have a lot of portable games, mostly on the PSP, um, that I would just like play more than my console versions because it was convenient. You know, even even when you're home, uh, you can uh, just kind of cuddle up on the couch <laughs> you know uh, away from everybody throw your headphones in and play like uh which was you know pretty close to console sports titles um back when they still kind of did those things on a portable console and so let me grab my psp here actually i have two psps and uh we'll pull those bad boys out and we'll talk about Sports games on PSP that I loved a lot. So here's my, um, I think I got this one second. This is my uh, silver uh, PSP, gray, whatever you want to call it, uh, right there. And uh, I also have the white PSP um, that I play um, even to this day. And I haven't played it probably that much in the last you know, few months or so, obviously because this bad boy is here. <laughs> uh, but it doesn't have the sports titles yet that I'm looking forward to. Um, but on my PSP, you know, I would play games like uh, MLB The Show. And I had, you know, uh, baseball games on the console. But, um, you know, like I said, the grindy nature of sports games, especially ones with long seasons like... Uh, baseball and uh, basketball um, I will play a lot more on the uh, portable and PSP was the portable of choice for sports games because there was barely any on uh, the DS I think the DS got like maybe one Madden game and that was not very good even though I bought it and played it pretty much uh, a lot that it wasn't very good and here is uh, NBA Live 10. Uh, back when I still played NBA Live, um, there wasn't much choice for basketball games on PSP. So you had Live, and then you had like uh, NBA from 989 Sports. Remember those guys? Uh, they were way bigger on the original PlayStation, the PS1. And they, I can't remember if they did too much on PS2. I don't think they did. But this was basically Sony's own sports studio, 989 Sports. And, you know, there was, you know, years where they rivaled Madden. So 
they get they did pretty well and i think they ended up getting disbanded at some point but uh, this yeah it's not that great i think this is like the early one of the earliest basketball games i think this came out in 2006 on psp and uh obviously like i said i mean i used to buy a lot of sports games um on psp um and i know i cannot find it but i know i have fifa somewhere fifa 08 uh somewhere i know i have it um i used to play the crap out of that there's madden 07 there's uh madden 06 if you can see let me get closer here there you go madden 06 psp it shows you madden 07 Here's Madden 08. Like, <laughs> you know, I wouldn't even buy the console versions because I would end up buying the P PSP versions because those are the ones I played the most. And you remember this series, NFL Street? There's Chad Ochocinco <laughs> on the cover back when he was Chad Ochocinco and not his, you know, government name, Chad Johnson. And then here is Fight Night, uh, round three. I used to play this a lot too, boxing. Boxing is one of my favorite sports, if you didn't know. And uh, uh, this is MLB. I'm not sure which one this is, but another baseball game um, for PSP. So, yeah, I mean, I played them a lot, um, especially in that time, 2006, 2007. I was in college. So, um, uh, I would play a lot on the city bus, uh, you know, uh, I'd go to school and, you know, between classes and play, you know, I'd just find a classroom and just kick back and pop out my PSP and, uh, you know, do a lot of, uh, sports gaming on it. And, uh, you know, there was a lot of commuting when I was in school because I would probably be on the city bus, you know, time wise, you know two and a half, three hours a day, some days, you know, depending on what day it was, how many classes I had, because um, I'd be going back and forth, I wouldn't want to stay, and I'd hit the bus, and, you know, I'd, I'd buy a, uh, a monthly pass, so I was, you know, basically uh, unlimited rides, so, but yeah, yeah, I used to play my PSP religiously on in those days, and now we have this illustrious console here, and uh, the sports games are starting to trickle out. You got, uh, what is it, uh, WWE 2K18, and you have uh, NBA 2K18, uh, <clears throat> which I am definitely getting on Switch. Um, and I have a real rough feeling that even with my EA boycott, I'm going to end up <laughs> uh, getting FIFA because I haven't played uh, a soccer game at least on um uh, on handheld especially for quite a few years and i used to play a lot uh fifa 08 on the go uh when i was in school and it's gonna be hard for me even with my principled stance i gotta find a way around it uh <laughs> hopefully but uh I, i'm probably gonna end up caving and getting that uh, but yeah, I mean, it's just just something I wanted to talk about, which I kind of forgot about. I think I'm, at some point I'm going to show you guys my PSP collection because it's, it's one of my favorite collections. Uh, PSP was a pretty boss little handheld. You know, some games sold, but a lot of games uh, that came out on it, PSP didn't sell. And uh, unfortunately... Uh, I think they had the proprietary, yeah, the proprietary memory card stuff that they took over to the Vita. Um, kind of hurt it too. But anyway, that's not what this is about. It's about sports games. Obviously, you've been seeing this loop of NBA Playgrounds, which I like uh, uh, mostly. But there's some things about it that annoy the crap out of me. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a video on that, about the online and stuff. Some funny stuff with that on the Switch version anyway. Uh, but yeah, um, I'm looking forward to playing more sports titles on my Switch portably and uh, on the big screen as well, obviously, but definitely portably. Um, there was something always really cool about getting, 
you know, a really good looking sports game on my handheld. And uh, DS didn't really have that because it wasn't as powerful. But uh, PSP definitely had that, uh, you know, good looking sports titles uh, that, you know, you know, if you blink would make you think it was the console version, but not really. <laughs> but they were really good. They were pretty full fledged. They were as far as the features and whatnot and modes. So, yeah, anyway, that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys think. Do you also uh, or did you also like playing sports titles on handhelds? Uh, 3DS didn't really get that many. Um, I have one of the soccer games, PES, I think 2011 or 20, yeah, 2011, 2012. I can't remember which one. Uh, I have PES on it, soccer, and that's pretty much it. Uh, the EA didn't do anything on 3DS as far as sports titles uh, or any titles, actually. Uh, maybe there's a few EA games I can't think of right now. But anyway, let me know what you think. Um, thank you, as always, for watching and listening, and I'll see you fools next time. Peace out. Oh, yeah. One more thing. Play Nintendo, fools. Nintendo.